Well, Joy, starting this weekend, passengers will start filling this Bellevue station at all hours. And because of that, the Bellevue Police Department has created its own police unit, which will help provide security. We've been waiting on this day for, I think, quite some time, much like everybody else. The wait is over for Sound Transit's two line to officially open. I think that will be very helpful. We're excited to have the light rail, but there are concerns, obviously, with, with it as well. She lives right across from the new Bellevue downtown station. It's one of the eight stations that will be operating through Bellevue and Redmond. She's glad there's another way to get around the east side but hopes this new line won't attract the same issues that other light rail stations have experienced. The drug use, um, you know, the, the needles, like how we see over in Seattle, um, possible violence, just being bothered, harassed. It's these types of concerns the Bellevue Police Department wants to stop in its tracks. We hear about, you know, regional issues that surround light rail and other transit related um, uh, areas, stations. And so, yeah, our goal with this light rail, this Bellevue light rail unit is to, again, to combat that. The new unit will be comprised of four officers and one sergeant overlooking the unit. It will patrol each of Bellevue's six link stops daily. These uniformed officers will be in pairs and monitor the Bellevue stations at most hours of operation from 530 in the morning until 930 at night. Patrolling the platforms, we want high visibility. And again, we want to ensure that uh, everybody utilizing transit and using utilizing the light rail, um, that they feel safe. We're confident that the police department will be able to help with a, a lot of those concerns. And the grand opening for this station and the other stations will be this Saturday with the official time that will be operating. The two line that is will be at 11 a.m. Joyce and Brady, you mentioned the security measures in place at the six Bellevue stops. What about the two Redmond stops? Well, officials with Sound Transit tell me that they will have security personnel at every single station on the two line. Meanwhile, officials with the Redmond Police Department says that it's planning on assigning officers to monitor the two Redmond stations. Brady Wakayama reporting live for us in Bellevue tonight.